just can't believe today actually happened. I can't, I just can't believe it. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm just so happy. <laughs> a right nosy neighbour this morning. Next door having a, um, a deck made at the end of their garden which is something that we originally wanted to do but not sure whether it will add enough value for how much it's going to cost us you know so not sure whether we're going to do it. Um, so we're really intrigued to see what theirs looks like, how long it takes and how easy and stuff it is to do. <laughs> this tea is much needed this morning. Still really struggling with my sleep it's just dropping off in the first place once i'm gone i'm fine i don't wake up or anything um it's just the initial drop off so i'm kind of a little bit stuck as to what to do i think i'm gonna have to increase my daily steps a little bit and um add in some more kind of heavier cardio to try and knacker myself out a little bit um i've actually got my second covid jab today so I don't really want to go to the gym after that because apparently it's not like a great idea. But tomorrow I'm going back to my badminton class, which I'm really happy about. I've been excited for that to start back up again. Um, so yeah, I'm going to head there tomorrow evening. I just really hope that the vaccine doesn't make me feel like that bad. Because um, yeah, I feel like moving my body a little bit more. Like one of my healthy habits was to move my body every day, which I've been doing. But I just I want to add in a little bit extra to see if I can just knack myself out a bit because I need sleep. <laughs> Welcome to another weekly vlog. <laughs> Toby wants to say hi. Are you saying hi to everybody? Oh, very nice new toy. Look at that. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> It's double vaccination day for me today. I'm gonna to go and get my second COVID jab and I'm really excited. I'm just crossing my fingers, toes and eyes that it doesn't make me feel too poorly. A few people have said that the first one, they just got an achy arm, which I had for a few days. Um, and then the second one has made them feel a little bit poorly. So I'm kind of hoping that doesn't happen because I've got a lot to do this week. <laughs> and I also want to go to my badminton class tomorrow for the first time in about a year and a half, which is just, <sighs> bonkers isn't it it's genuinely bonkers when you think about what's happened anyway um so yeah fingers crossed i feel okay um but i'm gonna head over there now and uh, and get jabbed <laughs> good morning team how are we doing it's thursday today i've been rubbish with the vlog again i know i do apologize and um, one of my vlogs the other day went like crazy viral it was like 29,000 views i had no idea somebody pointed it out to me in one of the little groups that i'm in and i was like i've got no idea why or how so um that was fun <laughs> I don't know why because honestly these vlogs these days are terrible anyway I'm so sorry I haven't been vlogging much this week at all I've been working on my little bum off my twitch guide is now live so if you or anybody that you know uh, wants to try streaming you can buy it it's $7.99 and it gives you like all of the the insider top tips really on how to start a channel and um, how to get affiliate for your twitch channel and also how to build a brand and start growing your community it's pretty good if I do say so myself um, and I'm really pleased pleased with it so hopefully that's going to help a lot of people because I get lots and lots of questions these days about Twitch and um, how to get into it and stuff and I've learned a lot in my four months on the platform so I kind of like just collated everything that I learned to get myself up and running into one easy to read and one easy to sort of um, find guide because there's loads of stuff on the internet about these things but it's all over the place and sometimes you find tips that are like buried in an article like on the fifth page google um that most people probably wouldn't find so yeah i thought it'd be easy to have it all in one place um so yeah if you're interested in that or you know anybody that is i'll leave a link down below uh what was i going to tell you oh yes i went to badminton yesterday my arms are killing me <laughs> My bum is killing me as well, obviously from all the lunging and stuff. I'm very, very unfit. I really do need to and want to get a lot fitter um, because I've just lost it all. I've lost all my fitness throughout lockdown. I've done little bits here and there, um, but I'm nowhere near as fit as I once was. I used to be able to play like three, four games back to back. I was like hanging out my ass after one game. <laughs> And also, I was missing so many shots. My skill level has just gone down the toilet. So, um, yeah, it was really nice. And I'm looking forward to going back again next week. I ended up in, like, the intermediate kind of session. 
uh, which is what I used to go to before, but I think I need to go back to the beginner section for a little while because uh, obviously these people have been playing for a good sort of month or so. I didn't realise it was back on. I only literally just found out that it was back on um, and they're all really good. So yeah, I felt like I was kind of like holding a few people back. I don't know. I wasn't the worst worst, but I definitely wasn't the best. So I think for the next few weeks, I might um, go the hour earlier and go to like the beginner slash intermediate rather than the intermediate slash pro <laughs> but yeah I'm really glad I went I'm really really glad it was great to move my body but on the way back to the car I got caught in a what I can only describe as a monsoon <laughs> <laughs> she had to be like 30 seconds to run to my car and I was dripping drenched so I had to wash my hair last night um but it's fine it needed doing anyway um and today I'm doing my daytime twitch stream yay so because everybody hit goals on our twitch last month it means that we've been able to add another stream to the schedule so I'm doing a day stream on Thursdays and I really love them I really look forward to doing them it's just a completely different vibe it's like not that they're, they're not chill but it's kind of like a party when we do our evening streams to be honest the day streams is kind of like we just drink tea we chat to each other people have me on in the background while they're working and um yeah it's really it's it's a nice sort of chill vibe uh so again if you are looking for something to listen to while you're working from home or if you would just like to support me anyway and um, please feel free on thursdays to have my stream open in the background you can mute me you don't <laughs> you don't have to listen to me I just kind of um we're working on our average viewers so because we want to make a partner on Twitch so you need I think 75 average viewers uh, per stream like you know people watching and we are on I think we got 42 last time which is really good considering we've like we've only just started basically um and i think our average at the moment is about 38 39 so we need to get to 75 so if you can help out by having me on in the background that would be great anyway i'm going to drink my cup of tea and finish going through my emails oh dear <laughs> and um yeah and then i'm gonna get myself ready to stream what a lovely day ahead. Anyway, I'll catch up with you in a bit. Bye! So to the date, we, oh my God, I've just spotted Toby and his dog. Team, can we just, can we just? He's brought his dog over and he's sleeping on it. Oh my God. <laughs> Bev, he loves it. If anybody's new, by the way, Bev gave us an amazing tip uh, he gave us 10 pounds well actually it was 20 it was very naughty um, and we used it to buy toby go on then <laughs> uh, this is how you know you're getting old when you get excited about new toothbrush <laughs> Got this toothbrush, it's from O'Clean. Oh, focus on there. It's called the O'Clean Elite. It's really fancy. So I was converted to Sonic toothbrushes last year, and this is a brand new one. It's so good. It's got like a little touch screen on it and everything. You can connect it to an app and stuff. It's very, very, very clever. Really, really good. If you haven't tried a Sonic toothbrush before, where you at? Where you at? <laughs> it's like that TikTok. <laughs> where you at? Um, you need to try a Sonic toothbrush. My teeth feel so much cleaner when I use a Sonic toothbrush. And it feels weird because obviously if you're used to like an electric one with all the bristles sort of rotating, this can like rotate, the equivalent of rotating, uh, like a bazillion times more, basically. I don't know the science. Uh, <laughs> I don't really recommend it though. It's so sleek as well. It's almost like a stone kind of feel to it. Oh, it's super sleek. Comes with a carry case too. Big fan, big fan, highly recommended. Is that your new carrot from grandma? Is it? <laughs> Do you love it? <laughs> Do you love it? Hmm? <laughs> hmm? I'm so glad we bought you this sofa. Okay? So very glad we bought you this sofa. 
Good morning, team. Got full face makeup on, curled my hair. Who is she? Um, today is the day where we're going to try on wedding dresses. And I'm really nervous. I didn't think I would be. I've been so chilled about everything. I think I'm just, I don't know why I'm nervous. I think it's excitement. I think it's like, yeah, I think it's like excited nerves because I've got nothing to be nervous about. There's, there's no drama. If we don't find the style that we want today, it's not the end of the world. There are other wedding dress shops and stuff. Um, I think I'm just excited, nervous, because it's, uh, oh, mum's here. I think I'm just excited, nervous, because it's an, it's, it's a nice day. Oh, I can't, I can't speak. I'm just a, I'm a little bit, ooh. Mum's here. Right, I've got to go. <laughs> I'll fill you in later. Oh my goodness, team, I can't, I can't. I'm just about to get in the bath. I'm just going to pour myself a glass of uh, champagne to celebrate. I can't stop crying, honestly, to celebrate the best day. <laughs> This is my makeup is just, I've had to reapply it about 10 times. I cannot tell you how incredible today has been. Oh, I feel so special. It's been the most special day, apart from the proposal, obviously. But, oh, I'm going to put some pictures in here. We took a few like uh, little bits of video and stuff, but um, we, we got loads and loads of photos because the place where we went, we went to this place called <laughs> Wedding Bells Love in um, Stoke-on-Trent. So if you're in the Midlands and getting married, I cannot recommend this place enough. They do, um, it's by appointment only, so you have the whole boutique to yourself and you can upgrade and pay for VIP appointments, which is what we had today, where you get, um, they're like 20, it's 20 pounds. It's 20 pounds do it <laughs> um and we got we got a tea cake and a bottle of fizz and we we had like an extra a bit of extra time as well so it's like two hours instead of an hour and a half for the normal appointments so worth it buy it buy it buy it and oh it was it was incredible the boutique is beautiful like super super cool and we went round and we put ribbons on all the dresses that we liked and i must admit i was useless as soon as i got in there i felt incredibly overwhelmed because they were all so beautiful and i have no idea what i wanted or any of it um so yeah let me just open this <laughs> i had no idea what i wanted uh, but the girls were brilliant. They were just, my, the girls and mum were just sticking ribbons on everything. They were like, this one, this one, this one. I'm like, okay, <laughs> I'll just try on anything. And oh my goodness, the dresses, team, the dresses that were in there were stunning. So, so beautiful. I can't even, they were... Oh, there were so many beautiful dresses in there and I tried on some things that I, I genuinely thought, no, I, it's not gonna suit me, it's not really what I want. And then it turned out they did suit me and they were kind of what I wanted. And oh, we got to take photos, which is the reason why I chose this boutique because apparently a lot of them don't let you take photos. But I wanted memories from the day. This is a huge day and I wanted memories and I wanted a picture of um, the bridesmaids and my mum's reaction when they saw me in a wedding dress for the first time, which we got. And oh, that I'm just going to treasure these photos forever and ever. We got some pictures of me in a wedding dress. So we didn't find the big question. Did we find the one? No, but we found two that are stunning and yeah, I, I basically I just want to combine those two dresses and um, have those like bits, like a bit from this one, bit from that one. Do you know what I mean? But oh gosh, if I, if I, if you literally said to me, you have to pick one of the dresses from today, I've got a winner and I would have that one. But I think, I, I yeah, I think I want to combine the two. Um, so yeah, but anyway, oh my goodness, it was... <laughs> I can't stop crying, honestly, it's been such a beautiful day. And then we went out for lunch and we looked through the photos because it's amazing how quickly you forget what these wedding dresses look like. And when you've got the photos, you can remind yourself of what they look like and what you look like in them. And they had veils and hair accessories and, oh, so uh, it was... <laughs> It was just the best day. I feel, I feel like a bride. I feel like, I just can't believe today actually happened. I can't, I just can't believe it. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited and yeah, it was, I can't, I'm just so happy. <laughs> I'm just so happy. <laughs> 
and I feel full of love and they were just fantastic I highly recommend them didn't feel any pressure oh, it was just it's just one of those days that you just want to put in a box and like multiply and if every day was like as lovely and as heartwarming and as happy as today life would just be incredible i'm just yeah so anyway <laughs> i'm gonna go and sit in the bath and look through those photos again and um drink a glass of champagne cheers to wedding planning and getting married and just having the most incredible day and i gave the girls their presents as well and asked them to be my bridesmaids and they were like yes they said yes no panic over <laughs> um yeah they said yes and they love the earrings and they love the cards and oh it's been the most wonderful it's been the most amazing day ever it's just a day that i never thought would happen and oh it's just it's lovely i'm going now bye